Hello everyone, I record this video uh, and you can use this as a uh, separate video or it can be part of those uh, RQ insurance because when we're moving forward, uh, we may have uh, some more uh, the usage uh, which need us to know uh, more about this uh, Archinate uh, modeling tool. Uh, so it's better if uh, we understand this, uh, uh, this tool's uh, structure which I put here. So this is the the basic structure uh, which I, uh, I will uh, take this video to explain some uh, the key uh, the element uh, that you know is uh, when you do the modeling front end uh, what happened on this uh, uh, the modeling file. Uh, in the right you uh, can see the R key uh, the website uh, and uh, here uh, on the, uh, the this uh, repository uh, I put our, uh, the additional page here, uh, which you can uh, refer to uh, some more information. Uh, I put the uh, blank model uh, like here. So uh, if you uh, analyze uh, the Archi model, uh, so when you save that, actually the extension is archimate.archimate, and the blank model is like this one. So it's in the XML format with a different folder uh, without any content. So that's the blank model. Uh, but you can see uh, here strategy, business, application, or uh, the different uh, folders. Uh, that Later on, you can see that mapping to uh, our modeling tree. <coughs> and also here, the relation. Uh, and the interesting part is whenever you create a diagram, a type is diagram, and a, uh, they are uh, the structured under the uh, views. Uh, you can definitely create a subfolder uh, on these uh, root folders. Then later on, you, you can see uh, what, what happened. But I will not go to too much uh, complexity, just to give you some basic uh, step Then you can interactively to see uh, the, uh, when you do something uh, in the modeling tool, uh, what happened uh, on the file. Uh, so I, I will follow on these uh, eight steps. Uh, let's uh, do some uh, element uh, adding, uh, changing, uh, adding the, uh, the description, adding uh, the property. And then we create a view and make some uh, the basic step on the view level. Uh, and then we, we can see uh, uh, when they add the relation, when they add the properties, uh, what was that to mean? The R key compared to some other uh, the enterprise architecture tool, it's a, a little different the philosophy. So in our key, actually, when you create an element, you cannot simply see like our ontology, uh, the uh, triple. You cannot just uh, state uh, the uh, one element have a relation to another element. You need to make our diagram. With a diagram, you draw a line. Uh, during the, this uh, diagramming, uh, you are making our state, uh, statement of the relationship. So, but some EA tool is uh, actually you can describe uh, this uh, triple uh, and uh, the backend they, they they will draw some visualization for you. So just uh, uh, notice like this uh, kind of difference when you're working with other EA tool. Uh, so let's uh, uh, come to uh, our uh, model. So. Uh, let's see. So we create our empty model uh, here. So uh, just to see is understand structure, file structure. So uh, whatever. So you can name for that. Uh, and then it's uh, less working on the, the kind of this uh, uh, the structures. Uh, let me create a folder. Uh, So here is nothing, uh, and then let's uh, save that. And you you, uh, you don't see uh, anything here, so because it's empty, uh, let's try to save. Uh, so when I uh, find this uh, on my repository, so you, you will see here. So let's uh, see what's that mean to us. So we have the file structure. So uh, the file structure, R key. Let me save on that. You can see here, you, know, you get a file. So what's this file? Uh, so hyphen. 
so let's uh, let's uh, start to analyze at what is exact uh, is what I put on the uh, the GitHub repository. Uh, so now you compare uh, left to the right is uh, the structure is quite uh, uh, clear. Uh, the all these uh, so the different layers, including others, uh, you have all them. Uh, just to, uh, notice that they have also the type. Uh, so like some is a different naming implementation called is implementation underscore migration. So because in open group, uh, the TOGAF uh, actually does this implementation and the migration uh, in the different uh, the, the ADM phase. Uh, and we have relation relations and a view view is here and view is here. By default, is, uh, you get our default view. So you can see uh, you have one line. Uh, this line is actually one content under the views. On other folder, there's empty. So uh, in the XML, is uh, the, the content uh, under folder is element. So then you see the type is uh, argument diagram model and name is uh, your uh, the view name. So that's is the default name. Uh, so starting from here is uh, let's uh, uh, change this. Uh, so uh, let's change that as uh, my view. So nothing changed, but when you click uh, Control plus S, you can see when you save your model, actually uh, what you are changing is uh, impact on this uh, name uh, property. Uh, notice this uh, every uh, the element, including folder and the name of the uh, this uh, uh, the view you have our unique ID. Uh, so this ID is uh, quite useful when you uh, have those uh, the, the scripting tool uh, want to do some programming to uh, change on that. Uh, and uh, it, it's not uh, the, my recommended, but uh, it actually uh, the, you can consider it's a wise word. If you change on the right part file, it's change on the model. Uh, so, for example, is uh, let's see. So here is uh, uh, I change directly on this uh, code. So if I save on the code, yeah, you don't see even you uh, you want to change change. So you don't see anything uh, the difference because here is you don't have that uh, refreshing. So let's close. So then let's uh, open that again. So see now when we uh, force uh, the model is. Uh, read again from the, uh, the content and you are changing on the right side also reflect in the left side so uh, but before you know clearly on this uh, structure uh, very well don't change on this because sometimes uh, that will destroy your photo structure uh, so that is uh, one thing so uh, I, I will uh, the, uh, uh, start to uh, follow our steps uh, in, uh, in this uh, video so uh, and then so uh, we can start to uh, modify something. So I stop here uh, and uh, let's see uh, this in the second video uh, for understand this uh, folder structure. Thank you.